Hey guys, it's TBW Flash 63 along with Russ Gun and Murphy Sealers. For safety. And today we are going to do a triple unboxing of the Midland HH54 VP2 version 16 um, at, from what we've gathered. Uh, Radio Shack 12262 and my Radio Shack 12522. It's oh, yeah. a V16HH because on the listing I saw the back plate did not have the middle logo. Oh, okay. Alrighty. So let's get, uh, uh, so let's see. What radio should we do? Let's see. One, two. Three, I think four. you should do the VP2 first. I don't know which one the VP2 is in, but I'm going to do this oh, one. Oh, yeah. Just do any of them first. I think this one's the 522. This, the 522 came from Boynton Beach, Florida. I guess you could say this is my Christmas present. Alrighty. Um. So, I have. Give me a sec. And. Okay, let's see. It's, it's in like a weird looking cotton candy looking ass foam, bro. Okay, and here is the radio. The Radio Shack 12522. Uh, wow, this thing's small. Here, I'm gonna, I'm gonna sh look at this. Yeah, that's, that's a pretty small radio. Well, I mean, it's basically an HH. So, uh, I'm gonna get batteries for it. So I'm going to get batteries for my 522 here in a second. But no, it did not come with a belt clip. So, literally just the radio bare bones. Oh, it has a it has a 5 volt power jack. Hmm. Okay, well, I'll keep that in consideration. So we're going to put that there. Next, let's do the Midland HH54 VP2. I wonder if it comes in a box. Uh, okay, let's see. How are we going to open this? Uh, the VP2, if it's new, it comes in an annoying clamshell. Oh, just like my VP. Also, but it's not new because of the list of things we showed, showed it well, it was out of the box. Yeah, it came in a pretty big box. I hope it's not like my 74200 where the guy, like, put in like three freaking parcels okay and this one has weird looking cotton candy as well Oh, it's in like it's bubble. Cotton candy with radio. It's in bubble wrap. Okay, let's see. Walmart.com. Oh, 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 this is my 262. Oh. Okay, well, this is this is my 12262. Okay, well, uh, let's, uh take you out then oh yeah it came with this adapter so let's see this came from my cousin by the way so thanks to him it looks in a surprisingly good condition uh and it's a08 so it's 2008 so it's a good 262 so we're gonna put everything here so we have the 522 262 now time for the vp2 oh that you know what's kind of funny all the model numbers of these radios end in a two which is cool okay it comes with its manual
Okay. The geeky two is really nice. Yeah. All right. So this is its uh, manual, and this is the charging cradle. Let's put you there. And here is the HH, which doesn't come with a freaking belt clip. Oh wait, nope, never mind. Oh, it's belt clip. Is, it, it comes with a belt clip. Oh yeah, because I know, I know, because of the listing, he had taken off the belt clip, but he still had it. Yeah, it looks like it's a version 16. I'll compare. Let me compare it with my. What did I do with my 15? Here you are. Yeah, stupid radio. They're almost the same on the outside, except if you look at the back, you'll you'll see that the V15 has a good look. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, they're version 16 and 15. Sweet. All right, and then this is the power adapter for my cradle. So what radio? Sh what radio should I set up first? Okay, so I'll get some batteries for it. Oops. So I will be right back. Back. All right. All righty. Let's see. Five two two. So, open the battery cover. I really yeah. like the colors on the on the five two two. Did it come with a belt clip? No, that's why I ordered one. Yeah. All right. It's on. Searching. Channel 7 available. Okay. That's a weird... Weird speaker. It sounds very interesting. Five miles an hour. Clear in and then becoming partly cloudy. And then the volume for the alert test. It kind of does. All right, so. Yeah, it sounds exactly like the Recon's watch It does. All right, so now uh, let's get the 262. Oh, yeah. Also, this is my other 262 that died. It's dead. It yeah, I took it apart. And then I'm going to change the dresser. Yeah. Well. Wait, what? All right. 262. I don't know where the hell I'm going to put my 262. Wait, what? <coughs> it came with a mid... This is the wrong adapter. What? <laughs> it's the wrong... I I plugged in the HH I plugged in the VP2's adapter into the 262. Hold on, I got a bunch oh. of, I got a bunch of crap. Yeah, that doesn't work. Yeah, hold on. I have a I have the 262 my other 262's adapter. Here we go. 
Signal loss. It works. Let's see. Let's go up to 16. Okay. Signal loss, slit channel. Backlight, yes. Oh my gosh, and now I'm, I'm used to the 521 setup. Select menu. Edmund Air Force Base, 67 at Brookshire. Okay, select channel. Backlight. On. Set country, US. Set language, English, yes. Set alerts, warning, advisory. Oh crap, now I gotta set all the stupid alerts. Transmitter. Okay, I keep, gotta, gotta keep setting this. That one's on. These are okay. So is your five two two working? Yes, my five two two works. So okay. Five, two, two. Required monthly. Required. Oh, power outage. National periodic. What I hate is that all these alerts are disabled. I know I'm not crazy. I like how advanced the radio shacks were because they had a they had a vent block. Yeah, they all, they had, like, event blocking. They were way ahead of their time. Okay, this is Jesse. Albeit, just kind of annoying. Wait, what is that? Practice demo. Why do they even tone, why is that even on an alert? They don't tone them. Alright, so I would say that that's... I would say that that's ready. Set alerts. Location. Oh, location. All. Sleep reminder. Alert reminder. Now I'm a pro at setting up radios. Alert mode. Voice. Okay. Channel. Alrighty, now it's time to set up the VP2. Next in the afternoon. The VP2 seems like a very nice radio. Okay, so let me put the batteries in the 262 before we... Yeah, I get the six batteries. Yeah. Oh, you checked? Also, I'm going to have to probably take one of the batteries from my GMRS radios to put in my H... to put in my VP2. Which I'm... Damn. Okay. So, uh, two, six, two. Now get the battery thing and close it. Has working batteries, so that's good. Oh, whoa, that's really cool. The five two two has a temperature thing. Nice. It's 73 degrees Fahrenheit. Wow. That's cool. It's cool. The record low is... Okay, well, I'm going to keep you... Right there, right that 262. Yeah, it does. Yeah, that's really cool. All right, I'm going to... Whatever I can, I'm probably going to get a 522. Whatever I can. Yeah. Big boy said no. Alright, so let me get the rechargeable for my, for my version 16. Uh, okay. So let's see, let me plug you in. I hope this rechargeable works, because I have multiple rechargeables that I don't know if they even work. It allows the charging light lights up. No, like, okay. Plugging you in. Uh, I don't think I plugged it in correctly. No, I plugged it in right. No, I don't think I did. Why 
is Colorado keep on getting avalanche warnings? <laughs> Insert with this fire, this side in. Oh, that's Utah. This battery seems to be dead, but I'll plug it in just to test it. Battery dead. I don't know, I because I haven't plugged in the charging cradle. Okay, here's the adapter for the yep. charging cradle. My room is now. Yeah, that's, also the, that's also the same adapter for just plugging straight in the radio. Okay, so DC in 9 volts. Okay, so let me see. I'm gonna plug you. It works. Version 16. Oh, okay, the, the, the battery sucks though. Uh, well, I mean, it has a Oh, I got it! I got it! I got it! I got it working. Let's try the test. Oh, <laughs> it died. It died while playing the siren. It died while playing. It died while playing the siren. Oops, it died. The same time. Well, I can't because they're gonna die. Hold on, let me get one of the let me get one of the chargers from the from my GMRS radios. Uh, you could use them. You're 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 fully charged. Wait, you're gonna those batteries suck. You can uh, you can just get one off the camera. Are you in line if I push the TX button? Right. I did that with my V15, but before it died. Oh. Okay, this is the one that this is the one that doesn't die. Oops. So I'm going to take your battery. Sorry, Midland Radio, but I'm going to have to take the battery out of you because you suck. Okay. Version 16. Okay. So let's see. Let me get the VP2 out of its charging cradle. Now let me pry open stupid freaking charging port. And then we'll be able to test it properly. Yay, now I can now I can flex on my VP2 to roleplay. Uh -huh. I said now I said yay, now I can flex on my VP2 to roleplay. I also have a VP2. So we can flex both of our VP2s. Yes. The BP2 of the is a really nice thing, though. Yeah. Okay, so I plugged you in now. Now it's full. Now it works. So let's see. Let's test both of them. Here, so let's see. Alright, now let's test them. Current time is 12.52 p.m. Yeah. Yeah. 12.52 p.m. Alrighty. Now let me set the time on the 5.22. How do you set alarm? Tone defeat. Wait! The 5.22 has... Oh, God. The 522 apparently has tone defeat. So like event blocking? It has event blocking. Oh. Warning. Well, not again, it's a radio shack. Yeah. Tone defeat. Advisory. How do you do this? Seal reminder. How the heck do you select? Hmm. 
Oh my god! If I only had the uh, hold on. If I only had the manual. So what rate are you setting up now? My five two two. Oh. Hold on. So you want Matrix? Yeah. Uh, no, what? no. It's a Radio Shack radio. Don't you remember? Yeah, it's typically a Radio Shack version of the H H. No, it's not. Yeah, it has more features. It has alert blocking. Right. Let me see. So yeah, this could just have more. Advanced. Version. Okay, so let me I look at. Yeah, it has a temperature sensor. I'm trying to find. The only Midland radio I know that has that is the 74250C uh, banana radio. Oh, but, yeah. No. Wait, it's locked? It says it's locked. There's a button lock? Ah, it's like a, it's like a button lock. Okay, well, I'll figure out how to set up the 522 later. Anyway, uh, that was TVW 563, uh, setting up my England HH54 VP2 version 16. Uh, my Radio Shack 12522 and my Radio Shack 12262. It's already open. Alright, well, uh, this is TVW 563 along with. Well, safety. And. Risk and emergency alerts. And I will see you all soon. Uh, bye bye.